So we've got a heating repair issue here. So we've got heating not working, hot water works, but heating doesn't work, yeah? So the first thing I did to figure out which one was the heating, which one was the heating two port and which one was hot water. So it's very easy to know, to check it, flow from boiler. And the one that goes into the cylinder is gonna be for hot water. This one is gonna be for, for heating, right? So first things first, I got here, made sure that I had power, so live, neutral, 240. Got the prongs there on live, neutral, and I've got 240 there. And um, second thing I did was, I got the programmer and I put it on continuous for heating. I went down to the thermostat and I turned that on up as well. I've come here, nothing's happened, nothing's changed whatsoever. So the next thing I did was to put this on to my neutral and to check the gray wire coming off here. Luckily, this has been wired into a five-way terminal box, so it's quite easy to check. So I'll go neutral to gray and put this here. Neutral to gray, because that should be 240, right? That's my common. So I realize I'm getting power to my two-port valve. Now, orange, this brown wire is the signal. Yeah, this is the, the switch. And there's no power on the switch. You can see nothing on the switch. So then after this, I went down to thermostat, followed it all the way back to here. And this was the stat wire here. You can see this one here. Went down to the thermostat. There's no power going into the stat. The common on the stat has no power. The common on the stat is right here. One, two, and if you have a look, There's no power on the common to the stat. So then I took the programmer out. You can see I took the programmer off. Took programmer off the wall. That then turns it on. So I've bypassed it. I've just put a link in between live and normally open. So I'm doing the programmer's job for it. I'm giving power straight direct to room stat. Once I did that, switched it all back on. Zone valve opened up because I'm now giving power to orange. Zone valve opened, orange got live, and it worked. So that proved that the problem was this programmer here. And then I'm now replacing that programmer with this EPH equivalent because this one here is obsolete. So program has now been changed, EPH, this one works the way it should. So the heating and hot water's on. You know it's on because you've got the zone valve here is loose. Zone valve here is loose. Now if I turn this off, you can see that zone valve move there. Yes, yeah, so it's moving, it's stiff, and it's, it's turned it off. I'm gonna leave this on continuous, sorted. So the issue here, was a faulty programmer. The programmer wasn't sending signal to the stat, then the stat wasn't able to send the, the signal to the three port, and the three port wasn't opening. Once I bypassed the programmer, it then sent signal to the, sent power to the stat, power to two port, and it switched the boiler on. 